A silent pandemic is sweeping the globe. It knows no borders and affects people of all ages and backgrounds. This hidden threat is antimicrobial resistance, or AMR. AMR occurs when bacteria, viruses, and other microbes evolve to resist the drugs designed to kill them. The consequences of AMR are dire. Infections that were once easily treatable are now becoming deadly. Our life-saving antibiotics are losing their effectiveness. We are on the brink of a post-antibiotic era where common infections could once again become fatal. Antimicrobial resistance poses a significant threat to global health. It has the potential to undo decades of medical progress. Surgeries, organ transplants and cancer treatments all rely on effective antibiotics. The World Health Organization has declared AMR one of the top 10 global health threats facing humanity. It's a complex problem that demands immediate attention and coordinated action. Antibiotics have been hailed as one of the greatest medical discoveries of the 20th century. They have revolutionized modern medicine and saved millions of lives. Before antibiotics, even minor infections could be deadly. Antibiotics work by targeting and killing bacteria. They have been instrumental in treating bacterial infections, such as pneumonia, tuberculosis, and sepsis. The discovery of penicillin in 1928 marked a turning point in human history. Antibiotics have made surgeries and other medical procedures safer. They prevent infections and allow for complex medical interventions. However, the overuse and misuse of antibiotics have fueled the rise of AMR. We are now facing a future where these miracle drugs may no longer work. The consequences for global health are staggering. Antimicrobial resistance is a natural phenomenon. However, the misuse and overuse of antibiotics have accelerated its development. When antibiotics are used inappropriately, it creates selective pressure that favors the survival of resistant bacteria. One of the main drivers of AMR is the overuse of antibiotics in healthcare settings. Antibiotics are often prescribed unnecessarily for viral infections which they cannot treat. This practice contributes to the development and spread of resistant bacteria. Another major factor is the widespread use of antibiotics in agriculture. Animals are often given antibiotics to promote growth and prevent infections. This practice further fuels the development of resistant bacteria, which can then spread to humans. The lack of new antibiotic development is exacerbating the problem. Developing new antibiotics is a costly and time-consuming process, and pharmaceutical companies have little financial incentive to invest in this area. The result is a dwindling arsenal of effective antibiotics. The World Health Organization has developed a global action plan to combat antimicrobial resistance. This plan outlines some of the strategic objectives to tackle the AMR crisis. These objectives provide a framework for countries to develop their own national action plans. One of the objectives is to improve awareness and understanding of AMR. This includes educating the public, healthcare professionals and policymakers about the importance of responsible antibiotic use. Another objective is to strengthen surveillance and research. This involves tracking the emergence and spread of resistant bacteria and developing new diagnostic tools and treatments. Another one is to reduce the incidence of infection. This can be achieved through improved sanitation and hygiene practices as well as vaccination programs. Also another objective is to optimize the use of antimicrobial medicines. This involves promoting antibiotic stewardship programs to ensure that antibiotics are used appropriately and only when necessary. Another objective is to ensure sustainable investment in combating AMR. This includes funding for research and development, as well as support for countries to implement national action plans. The Guardians of the Front Line Healthcare professionals play a critical role in combating antimicrobial resistance. They are the gatekeepers of antibiotics and have a responsibility to prescribe and use them responsibly. Healthcare professionals must stay informed about the latest guidelines for antibiotic use. Education is paramount. Healthcare professionals need to educate their patients about the importance of responsible antibiotic use. They should explain that antibiotics are not effective against viral infections and should only be taken when prescribed by a healthcare professional. Stewardship programs are essential. 
hospitals and other healthcare facilities should implement antibiotic stewardship programs to promote the appropriate use of antibiotics. These programs involve tracking antibiotic use, monitoring for resistance, and providing feedback to prescribers. Collaboration is key. Healthcare professionals should work together to share best practices and develop strategies to combat antimicrobial resistance. This includes collaborating with pharmacists, infectious disease specialists, and other members of the healthcare team. Knowledge is power. Public awareness is crucial in the fight against antimicrobial resistance. Everyone has a role to play in preventing the spread of resistant bacteria. Education campaigns can inform the public about the importance of responsible antibiotic use. Hygiene is paramount. Simple hygiene practices such as hand washing and covering coughs and sneezes can help prevent the spread of infections. Vaccines are also essential in preventing infections and reducing the need for antibiotics. Responsible antibiotic use is critical. The public should be educated about the importance of taking antibiotics exactly as prescribed and completing the full course of treatment, even if they start to feel better. They should also be advised to never share antibiotics with others or save them for later use. Advocacy can make a difference. The public can advocate for policies that support responsible antibiotic use and investment in new antibiotic development. This includes supporting legislation to restrict the use of antibiotics in agriculture. A global call to arms. Antimicrobial resistance is a global health emergency that requires a coordinated and multifaceted response. Governments, healthcare organizations and individuals must work together to address this urgent threat. International collaboration is vital. Countries need to share information and resources to track the spread of resistant bacteria and develop effective strategies for prevention and control. Investment in research is essential. We need to develop new antibiotics, vaccines and diagnostic tools to stay ahead of evolving resistant bacteria. This requires sustained investment in research and development. Policy changes are necessary. Governments can implement policies to promote responsible antibiotic use in healthcare and agriculture. This includes regulating the sale of antibiotics and promoting antibiotic stewardship programs. Individual actions matter. Everyone can play a role in combating antimicrobial resistance by practicing good hygiene, using antibiotics responsibly and advocating for change. How is the future of health? The future of healthcare hangs in the balance. If we fail to address the threat of antimicrobial resistance, we risk returning to a pre-antibiotic era where simple infections could once again become deadly. The consequences for global health and the economy would be catastrophic. However, there is still hope. By raising awareness, promoting responsible antibiotic use, investing in research and strengthening global cooperation, we can slow the spread of antimicrobial resistance and preserve the effectiveness of these life-saving drugs. The time to act is now. We must work together to ensure that future generations have access to effective antibiotics. The health of humanity depends on it. Stay informed, stay healthy, and see you in the next episode.